We're back now with today's talker, the story that vindicates any teenager who's been told they spend too much time playing video games. Yes, Kyle Booga Giersdorf, a 16-year-old from Pennsylvania, won the first ever Fortnite World Cup on Sunday. And get this, he netted $3 million in the process. We'll talk to Kyle and his parents in a moment. But first, a look at his historic win. Surprise. Bow down to Booga! The victory was a first of its kind. Sixteen-year-old Kyle Giersdorf took home the title and a whopping three million dollar grand prize at the first ever Fortnite World Cup. Millions competed to get in, but only 100 were chosen to play. At the end of the nearly four-hour gaming competition, Giersdorf, who goes by the name Booga, secured the top spot. Words can't even explain it right now. I'm just so happy. Everything I've done, the grind, it's all paid off and it's just insane. The tournament packed New York's Arthur Ashe Stadium with nearly 10,000 fans. This is a zone with more than graphics. one million more watching the intense competition online. Sunday's victory means even more for the fairly new but wildly successful esports industry. Revenues for professional video game competitions is expected to hit $1.1 billion in 2019. That's 27% more than last year. future that is only beginning for Giersdorf, who says he is still taking it all in. Champion of the world! And Kyle is here along with his parents, Glenn and Darcy. Guys, good morning. Thanks good morning. for being here. Thank you. So, Congrats. Thank Thank you. First things first, Kyle or Booga? What do you prefer? <laughs> Probably Booga. Booga. Okay, I'll call you Booga. So I asked you a minute ago, what are you going to do with three million bucks? I proposed maybe you buy a new car. And you reminded me you don't have a driver's license yet because you're only 16 years old. So what are you going to do with all that cash? Just save the money, put it to my future, and uh, probably buy a new desk. A new desk? Yeah. <laughs> Not right. even a new computer? No. Nah. No. Okay, so, I mean, we, are, we, we don't play Fortnite. Some of our viewers probably have never played Fortnite. How did this happen? What did you have to do to win and become world champion and get three million bucks? Uh, it's taken a lot of time, like hard practice over the past two years. I've just dedicated like all of my time into improving and getting better pretty much. So there are 40 million players over a 10 week period, 40 million in this tournament. You get down to 100 on the big stage at Arthur Ashe Stadium in New York where you won on Sunday. What was it like to win, be handed that trophy and that check? It was honestly like surreal, but at the same time, it like I had no emotion honestly, because like I didn't really understand like what was happening. But uh, it's it was just crazy. So you're there, people are watching. Mom and Dad, I mean, in your wildest imagination, did you ever think your son's love of video games would lead to something like this? Oh. I mean, we knew we he had it in him, but the whole experience was so surreal and. I just still, I had to ask my sister, like, am I dreaming? Is this really real? I was, we were so in shock. So how often do you play? How many hours a day do you play video games? I'd say like six hours a day of practicing. So how do you do your schoolwork and all the other stuff? Fit it in with like free periods during like school and also like after, just after like an hour or two. So Glenn, we've sort of been joking all morning and I'm sure a lot of parents are thinking the same thing. I go and I tell my kids, stop playing Fortnite. What am I supposed to say now? He won three million bucks playing Fortnite. Did you guys ever have those moments where he was in playing six hours a day? Absolutely. Uh, we still have them. Yeah. <laughs> um, you know, it's all in moderation, you know, and we always told him that as long as his grades were up, we would support him and we would try to do what we could. And as soon as the grades would start slipping, then we said, in, which they haven't, thank God, um, we said that, you know, we're, there's consequences to that. Mm -hmm. uh, because, you know, as talented as he is, I've always said there's a 12-year-old that's coming up mm -hmm. that's going to have the same skill sets and it's going to, you know, be better. And in, by the time he's 25, 30, I don't want him working at, you know, a fast food restaurant. Yeah. How, okay, can you tell us how where Booga comes from? Uh, my grandpa gave me the name. He did? Like, when I was like a baby. Is it Booga or Booga? Booga. 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 Yeah. Mom, what do you think about Booga? 
I love it. Yeah, I love it. It warms my heart. Aww. So, Kai, what are you going to do from here? What do you? I mean, I know you're still basking in the glow, but where do you do with this? You're you're famous now. You got some money in your pocket. What do you want to do? Honestly, I'll probably just get back home, get some rest, and then start my stream up and play Fortnite again. <laughs> <laughs> and get ready for your junior year in high school, right? It's got a repeat. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. Well, guys, congratulations, Congrats. Kyle. Thank it's you an so incredible much. achievement, Mom, Dad. Thanks for being here Enjoy as well. You. Nice Thank to you meet for you. Having us. Thank you.